Now for a story you'll see only here on Western Mass News. The Valley Bike Share Program throughout Western Mass has been in place for more than a year. If you've ever wondered exactly who's keeping those bikes in working order, his name is Pete Rooney. If you haven't given it any thought, Western Mass News reporter Artie Russo shares why you should. <laughs> if you had asked me if I was going to be working for a bike share, you know, three years ago, I probably would have laughed at you. Pete Rooney knows he doesn't fit the description of your average mechanic or that of an average bike rider. It's incredibly ironic to me, but it's also amusing. Pete, whose positive attitude is infectious, <laughs> has served as the station mechanic for Valley Bike Share for the last year. Before that, he served in the Army. I was injured by a roadside bomb in Ramadi, Iraq where he lost both of his legs in 2007. Certainly have, uh, you know, moments where I falter a little bit too, just like anybody would, but overall I just have always had the attitude, don't give up and always keep pushing forward. Pushing himself forward to use a wheelchair, drive a car, and fix bikes every day with Core Logistics, a company that hires veterans for service jobs. All over here and we're having a couple of beers with my guys, and Pete was there. The company's CEO, a veteran himself, knew the moment he met him that Pete would fit in with the rest of his team. I said, don't worry, we'll figure something out. And I came in the next day and been working for him ever since. Just because you're handicapped doesn't mean you can't continue to be, you know, an example for others. You can see the map of all the Valley Bike Share stations here in Northampton. Anytime there's an indication that a bike isn't charging properly, Rooney has to come out to the station and see what the problem is. I need to measure the voltage of the, the dock itself. And I use these magnets. These brass connectors are what makes the connection with the dock and actually helps to, to power it. It's still not charging. <laughs> I didn't fix anything, but at least we know that the dock is functioning so that it's not a problem for every bike that goes to the, the dock. Quietly working to keep the stations in shape, Pete's success is about more than how well the bikes pedal. Pete, the key for success for you is all about the next guy who said he could never get a job or girl because they had lost the limbs. It's about setting an example for those who need a little help pushing forward. Having the opportunity to do this and then maybe inspire some other veterans to, to get out of their house and keep trying to push forward and keep working. I like, really like that. In Northampton, Audrey Russo, Western Mass News.